Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to tonight's episode. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. Uh, I am your host, my name is Charlie, and as always, I am proud to present another great video for you guys. So yes, we are here. I missed the hell out of you guys. I missed you guys. I see some new members to our family, so I wanna thank you guys for joining us. Thank you so much. Uh, we hope you stay, we hope you like it. Check out other stuff that we got going on. You won't regret it. You're gonna love that shit. If you aren't subscribed yet, what you waiting for? You know, uh, I'm lonely over here, come on, help me out. No, I'm kidding, but uh, for real, if you have not subscribed yet, you know, make sure you get on top of that, cause you're the best. And how are you doing at home? How's your life been? Let us know, let me know, I, I, I wanna read that shit. I wanna read what, I wanna read what's going on in your life. <laughs> make sure to let us know because you matter and we care about you. I've recently came back from a trip from Hawaii and god damn do I love that place. That place has my heart, my soul. If you ever get a chance to go to Hawaii, please go. You guys wanna check some out real quick? I don't know if you guys can tell, but... Can you tell? I don't know if you guys could tell, but my arms are kind of gross. I've been peeling. I got really sunburned and I got really fucked by the sun basically. Do we have any cool footage? Do we have a cool montage that we can give to the audience? Our editing team is working on a great uh, montage for you guys. You know, little videos, clips from Hawaii and uh, we hope you enjoy. Okay, they're telling we might not. So recently I saw a comment that caught my attention and I uh, decided I wanted to bring it up here so we can talk about it. So uh, it goes like this. From Alice in Dickland. I love her fucking username. <laughs> OMG, she's a hell of a MILF. But that's not the comment I wanted to highlight. The comment I wanted to highlight was this one. From Don Mono 666 Let's make a video, you and me, so you can see that you become more viral than you are. God damn, that's a thirsty ass mother. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the true definition of having no standards. How are you gonna ask somebody like that online? Especially something like that. Also, I wanna highlight the stupidity of that comment. That shows a failed attempt to manipulate somebody into having sex with somebody. As you can see, he can determine her success by telling her that, hey, you should make a video with me and you'll get more views. Check out how successful you'll really be. Just have sex with me. Hey, that rhymes. This is as if I were to contact PewDiePie and telling him we should collab so I can help him get his views up. Now, obviously he's not gonna go for that because I'm a fucking nobody. And of course I'm not gonna help his career just as this idiot believes he can help her career. But you know, obviously we already said that he doesn't wanna help her career at all. He wants, he just wants to fuck. He just wants to get his nut. This is to all my players and to all my men. You cannot have your standards that low. We gotta raise them. We always gotta keep it pushing. That's our mission here. And to all the beautiful, strong women out there, you know, you gotta keep an eye out for these suckers cause they'll ruin your life. You can tell that this motherfucker has nowhere to go in life. And that's just being real. You think all the millionaires and billionaires out there spend their time on Pornhub asking people out through online sites? Maybe. 
maybe but anyways what the fuck am i talking about come on let's get back to the video let's focus i'm sorry i went off the rails there so ladies and gentlemen i feel like i kept you waiting long enough so let's talk about today's video okay today's video is going to be a guitar session can you guys guess what song we'll be learning today it's okay i'll wait it's okay come on throw in your guesses right now uh-huh uh-huh okay close close that's that's pretty close today's song we'll be learning will be superman by eminem we'll try to learn a little bit of it i'm gonna go through a quick rundown of parts of the guitar baby hold on baby hold on baby ba baby stop we're filming a video <sighs> Girl, we're, we're filming a video, okay? An important part of the guitar that you need to know are where the frets are. The frets are gonna be these places right here. Let's talk about the strings, okay? The highest string will be E, then A, then D, then G, then B, then E, or well, minor E. And to give you guys a quick rundown, this is how they sound. So let's go ahead and try to play Superman just the first part the very very first part. Okay, we're gonna be on our second fret now Our fingers are gonna be on the, the D string and G string, right? And we're gonna play strings a D and G so it'll sound like this Ooh, That's cold right there fuck the second part is gonna be a pain in the ass because you have to switch your hands real fucking quickly and I'm not there yet. I'll be honest. I am not there yet. So we're going to run through it slow. Okay. So what you will need is to be on the second and third fret. Okay. And there's going to be a lot of fast moving back and forth. We're going to be playing on the A string for three chords. So the first chord is going to be on the A. And then after that quickly is going to be with your index finger on the second fret on the second string. And then quickly fuck you why does it sound like that is it loose or something is it my guitar and then after that is gonna be in the D string on the second fret and finally no fingers on any frets it's gonna be the G string now the third part is telling us that we're gonna be only on the second fret and we're gonna play three strings we're gonna be on the second string on the second fret and the other strings that we're gonna play are gonna be D and G. It'll sound and look something like this. And now for the fourth part, let's go ahead and check that out. So it seems like we're gonna be playing the first string, second string, and third string. In other words, E, A, and D. And we're gonna have our fingers on the second fret for two strings, and it's gonna be the, the A and D. So same as the first one we did, but just a little bit higher, just a little bit higher. So that was the quick and basic rundown of the finger placement parts for the song. Now we're gonna try to put all this shit together and believe me that's gonna be the hardest part. There we go, there we go. We're gonna be on the second fret, but first string we're, we're gonna hit normally without no fingers. So it goes like this. And then we put our index finger on the second fret. Move on to the third. Move on back to second fret on third string and finally hit fourth string with no finger on it Damn, the only part that I'm really proud of is the first part. I feel like that one I got down really well. Seems like that was all the time for tonight. And again, let me tell you guys that I appreciate you guys so much for coming out. Subscribe, check out more stuff. We got a lot of fun shit out there. And it's, well, it's only more to... So yes, we love you guys. I love you guys. Yeah, let's get the fuck out of here.
My bad. I mean, cutie pie.